What's up guys, it's CJ from SmartKTech.com and today we're checking out Gameloft's Modern Combat 3 Fallen Nation. It's a first person shooter and I've got to say it's pretty impressive. You can find it in the Android market for $6.99 and that'll buy you 13 campaign missions in an online multiplayer mode. I'll place a link for it in the description below. So let's see how it runs on this Samsung Galaxy Nexus. So as you can see, we're in this little intro story mode right now. It should jump into action any second now. Let me go ahead and turn up the sound for you guys. Now you'll see in a second this game has awesome graphics even uh, in regular gameplay. So here come the little enemies. Let's take them out. So we've got a little scope on this gun, slow motion headshot there. Alright, took out all of those enemies. We should move on now. There's a little rocket. Now you can see all these enemies coming out, but I'm just going to uh, go straight for this tank right here. And blow everyone up. Alright, so here's an interesting way to interact with the game. Uh, you actually motion or swipe control to go down this line. Here we go. So swipe down. I don't know what happens if you swipe the wrong way, but uh, I haven't tried that yet. Okay, so here comes a chopper blowing out all the windows. Check out the detail in this game. I mean, even the carpet looks pretty good. If you look over here, the glare of the sun, very, very cool. You can even shoot out the window. Alright, so let's go ahead and move on. There's a lot of colorful language in this game as well. It's pretty funny. Alright, so let's go into the little control booth up here. Alright, so let's go ahead and play with the computer here. So as you can see, you control your uh, movement with the left side of the screen. Let me duck down here. And then you aim with the right side of the screen. And then you have little buttons here to fire and throw grenades and whatnot. Now you can customize the layout of these buttons and move them around in the settings menu also adjust the sensitivity of the controls and there's a chopper boom looks like that chopper is done unfortunately so let's go ahead and head for the lobby Now you can see these guys are sort of just standing there. Let's go ahead and sneak up on them. You can see a knife appears. And that means you can do some uh, close combat moves. Pretty cool. So let's move on here. Go down the elevator. Alright, we gotta take out some guys here, so I'm gonna duck down. And 
and take them out from afar. Looks like I got those two. Alright, so it looks like we're finally clear. Let me go ahead and jump down here. Now you can see there's a little button down here that allows you to run. So you can get places much faster. I'm following this guy. Where is he gonna lead me? Looks like to an ambush, sort of. This would be a good place to use some nades here. Now let's try this. There's one, and there's the other. All right, that was pretty cool. So we saw we had to avoid that crushing blow. All right, it's about to get hot in this area. Blow this wall up. Yeah. 
Now we can go and jump on that turret. There we go. Now it's my turn. Uh-oh. Looks like it's overheated. Alright, no problem. Moving on anyway. And I'm a little disoriented. Oh. That was pretty cool. It was in slow motion and I had to use my handgun. Time to t check, t take out this chopper here. Boom! And that went down really quickly. Looks like we're nearing the end here. And here comes our fighters to the rescue to blow up the tank. And that about does it. So again, this was a look at Modern Combat 3 Fallen Nation for Android. It's by Gameloft and you can find it on the Android market for about $7. And I'll place a link for that in the description below. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more uh, video reviews.